An upcoming divorce trial has all the elements that make tabloid reporters drool. Sex, hundreds of millions of dollars, bold-faced names at stake, the face of the L.A. Dodgers. Monica Bertrand has more on the story. Monica. Well, Ginger, let's start with that. Jamie and Frank McCourt, they own the Dodgers. And in the latest edition of Bloomberg Business Week, their divorce is described as a bitter one. Frank accused Jamie of infidelity. Jamie says her husband is trying to cheat her out of her share of the Dodgers. Now, the trial is scheduled to start August 30th. Here are the McCourts in happier days. They welcomed their new manager, Joe Torrey, and his wife to L.A. But last summer, they separated after 30 years of marriage. Last October, Frank fired Jamie as CEO, and a judge upheld that firing. At issue now is a marital property agreement that gives Frank sole uh, ownership, I should say, of the Dodgers in the case of divorce or death. Jamie would get the couple's houses. Now, Jamie McCourt, she's a lawyer. She signed the agreement, but says that she never read it. And about those houses, well, they have two homes in Beverly Hills. It costs about $27 million, another $27 million for a beach house, and $19 Million home, uh, million for a home next door. And there was also a $5 million home in Cabo St. Lucas, but that's been sold to pay legal bills. Now, what about the Dodgers? Well, the McCords still owe $525 million for the team. But the team could bring up to $900 million in a sale. Now, Jamie McCourt wants to buy her husband's share of the team. A judge in the case says the team may eventually have to be sold just to pay the bills of the couple's high-powered lawyers.